welcome to a year in the life of autism day 203 I think <coughs> I'll check that you know what I'm like I can never remember um, so today has been good actually it's been a good start we had um, Joe and Stephen from the Scarborough Comet come to our house we were having a nice chat with them um, after you know working alongside them for so long it was so nice to meet them in person um, I've met Joe previous but never actually Stephen so yeah really nice to sit down have a good chat with them and uh, get some things sorted out so hopefully some more exciting things to come um, in the not too distant future um, also yeah Charlie's been lovely today and he's really trying to form his words today I love days like that um, every now and then he'll have a day like that and it's his burr noises and he's proper making the it's actually quite strange to look at because Charlie just normally you know, he makes his ee -E -E noises, but forming letters that require muscle, you know, it's it's strange to see him actually almost talking. <coughs> Brilliant, fantastic, but a strange experience after, you know, we're coming up nearly six years of, um, six years of silence. Obviously not literally silence, you guys know that, but in terms of talking, yeah, silence, so... That's incredible. Um, he's just on the cusp of it, and I cannot wait to uh, to hear that first properly formed word. That'll be the most exciting day of my life. Um, but yeah, he's he's been doing a lot of that today, um, and we had a nice walk into town with me and Charlie, and that was really nice. Um, it's nice to you know during the holidays. We definitely don't get a chance to do it during the you know during the school days. So, and especially not during the holidays, have some one on one time with Charlie. Um, it's difficult to pull off. Um, so that's really really nice and uh, I enjoyed that, that was that was lovely and I forgot completely what uh, what else I was going to tell you guys which happens um, yeah so it's, Charlie's been really good, he's been fantastic interactions, he's been playing uh, so we had a, a good morning, we met Joe and Stephen, that was really really nice um, there's like a million things we've got planned but I can't let you guys know what I'm about with just yet um, and yes, I think I think our goal now, um, currently, as you guys will see on the page, um, you know, we'll keep popping random posts and things up. It very much now is the time to expand. There's no, there's no way further we can go forward without going bigger and better. Uh, and so that's what we're gonna do. Um, we, we have. We've started the ball rolling now, um, and we're slowly building momentum to do something incredible, um, and really change the world for for autistic people, um, and that's all down to you guys. Um, you know, liking us and sharing us and supporting us, um, and then getting the backing of some very good people, um, you know, and, and the media and stuff like that. We're slowly shifting into a position where we are able to help people, and that just blows my mind because that's all we wanted to do from the start. Um, so, if you guys, you know, if you stick with us, we'll, we will bring about changes, I promise you that. Um, but you do have to obviously bear with us because it's not an easy road, um, as you guys know. So, yes, it's, it's, I'm just, I'm, I'm overwhelmed. We're getting places, is what I'm saying. I'm feeling really, really positive today about our, the future of, um, you know our, our parent organisation, which is Words for Words. Um, we want to push that forward, as well as the Year in the Life of Autism, because technically Year in the Life of Autism is under Words for Words. Um, and you know that'll always be my baby, Words for Words, because it was the first thing we sort of first, you know, organisation and 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 time we really dipped our feet in the in the autistic world in terms of helping people obviously Charlie's always been autistic but in terms of helping people was words for words so I don't want to let that go um, and obviously we've got the hashtag let's handle words be heard branded under words for words so um, but obviously I can't put to one side how big a year in the life of autism has become so it might be a case of meshing them together and, and bringing something bigger and better out of the two of those projects but that's obviously a lot longer further down the road so but if you guys bear with us we you know we'll get those places and we'll, we'll get things done for you guys um, and not just for you guys but for everyone across the world you know it's time things happened and it's time changes were made because um, you know I know you guys are fed up with how daft and, and, and crazy and 
utterly pointless and warped you know some of the aspects of the system is and our children are being failed and enough's enough like, I can't do anymore um, and again I said like the video I, when I'm being positive I always sound like I'm being negative I'm not I'm very much being positive about this it means I've got drive and I've had a few flaggy days where I've sort of bogged along but I've got that fire burning once again uh, and I will do this for you guys me and Amy will promise you but I'm going to leave it there anyway guys because I've got Charlie's dinner on, but yeah, he's been super mood. He loved Stephen and Joe uh, coming. He was very happy to see them um, and introduce himself. And uh, yeah, we had a nice walk into town. That's about it for today. I'm going to try and get to the park tomorrow if the weather holds, because it seemed to have held a bit today, but we weren't sure. So, But thanks for watching, guys. As always, take care of yourselves and let silent words be.